Hey folks, this is Brian Ludden with Pinnacle Property Group. And we are here today at a custom home build for a client. This is a uh, basically a modified Marlin floor plan uh, that we started off with. And we basically took it and we took the third star garage and we turned it into a billiard room and then also took part of that uh, room uh, and used that as far as for the laundry room. We also took the back hallway, pushed that back, um, so you have a little bit more room inside for the uh, dining room slash great room area as far as for living space. So first thing I wanted to point out is up above is that we did the um, uh, a metal roof. This is a standing seam metal roof. Okay, and then also with the front interior of the home over here, uh, we have a, again, a taller um, beam across the front. So basically this is a 10-8 um, uh, uh, beam. So we added two courses to the top and we did the smooth finish as far as for the entry way. So let's walk into here through the main area. So we have the 10 foot slider going out to the outside. And then over to my right over here, this is going to be the billiards room. Over here would be the, typically where you would see the third star garage. Um, but we basically expanded this into living space. And then back over here, we have the laundry room for the washer and dryer. So this is gonna be a vacation rental for the homeowner. Um, so it's three bedrooms, three baths. Um, it doesn't have a junior master suite, but each one of the bathrooms has, each one of the bedrooms has a bathroom off of it. So over here we have the entertainment niche over here and the homeowner will be putting a small fireplace over here and then for the kitchen they went with again a quartz sparkling white uh, countertop with a waterfall edge on each side over here we have where the refrigerator will be going and then we have the microwave with the stove top. Okay, so we are in bedroom number two. Um, this has a ensuite bathroom. Um, in this bathroom, it has a single sink with toilet and a tub shower combo. Okay, so we are going to check out the third bedroom. The third bedroom is, I would call it somewhat of a junior master suite. What we did is we put a door going off of here for where the pool bath area is and the third bedroom. So over here we have a single sink base with a shower. And just to the right of that, we have the third bedroom that goes out into the pool area. So they did a nine foot sliding glass door out to the rear. So we are over here in the pool area. First thing that I'd like to point out is that we have a beautiful picture frame pool cage. So this is really great, especially when you have, when you're on the water and you want to preserve your views. Um, the homeowner did a pool decking of a uh, ivory uh, travertine stone finish. So this is a enhanced feature that the homeowner went with. And then we have a, basically what I would call a um, uh, at level spa. You can see this over here with a, that's probably about one or two inches out of the water line of the pool. We have steps going into the pool. All right, so over here, the homeowner went with a 
sliding glass door off of the dinette area. Um, this is a three panel sliding glass door. And this is really nice because the homeowner did the affinity edge as far as for the spillover. So when you're sitting inside the house and looking out, it's going to give you um, that uh, seamless view of the water uh, from the pool into the water of the canal. In the lanai area, we have two 10 foot sliders um, and the homeowner did not go with the 90 degree corner, but we still have this nice uh, 10 foot slider here and a 10 foot slider into the great room. And then we have a nine foot sliding glass door that comes off of the master bedroom. All right, for the outdoor kitchen slash summer kitchen area, the homeowner went with a slight, slightly different setup. Uh, we have the pre plumb um, and then we have the TV that will be set up over to the right here. And we have a um, opening that is screened in and the homeowner will have a grill over here that they'll be able to take and roll out. Thank you for watching this walkthrough tour of our modified Marlin custom floor plan. Uh, please remember if you are in the market for a resale or looking to sell your house or a new construction inventory home, please check out our website at pinnaclepropertygrp.com. Um, if you're looking to build on your lot or do a custom home, please contact us at pinnaclebuildingsolutions.com. Until next time, I'm Brian Ludden with Pinnacle Property Group.